When the two of you reach a natural stopping point, I'd like to have a word. If the word is pee pee, just do it. <laughs> Leonard, you're my friend. And friends support their friends, apparently. So I'm withdrawing my objection to your desire to have a relationship with Leslie. Thank you. I will graciously overlook the fact that she is an arrogant, subpar scientist who actually believes loop quantum gravity better unites quantum mechanics with general relativity than does string theory. <laughs> you kids have fun. Hang on a second. Loop quantum gravity clearly offers more testable predictions than string theory. I'm listening. Amuse me. <laughs> okay, well, for one thing, we expect quantized space-time to manifest itself as minute differences in the speed of light for different colors. Balderdash. Matter clearly consists of tiny strings. <laughs> Are you gonna let him talk to me like that? Well, there's a lot of merit to both theories. No, there isn't. Only loop quantum gravity calculates the entropy of black holes. <laughs> Sheldon, don't make that noise. It's disrespectful. I should hope so. It was a snort of derision. You agree with me, right? Loop quantum gravity is the future of physics. Sorry, Leslie. I guess I prefer my space stringy, not loopy. Well, I'm glad I found out the truth about you before this went any further. Truth? What truth? We're talking about untested hypotheses. It's no big deal. Oh, it isn't really? Tell me, Leonard, how will we raise the children? <laughs> I, I guess we wait until they're old enough and let them choose their own theory. We can't let them choose, Leonard. They're children. Wait, where are you going? I'm sorry. I could have accepted our kids being genetically unable to eat ice cream or ever get a good view of a parade. But this? This is a deal breaker. Look on the bright side. What's the bright side? Only nine more months to Comic Con. 